Camille Vasquez is speaking out about why her client Johnny Depp filed an appeal in response to ex Amber Heard's own appeal, following his June 1 defamation trial win against her. After Heard, 36, filed a notice of appeal with the Virginia Court of Appeals on July 21, 59-year-old Depp filed his own notice of appeal the following day seeking to overturn the $2 million verdict in Heard's countersuit. In a conversation with Gail King that aired Thursday on CBS Mornings, Vasquez said Heard's appeal was expected from Depp's legal team, as the Aquaman actress has indicated, since the day she lost the trial, that she was going to appeal. Asked by King, 67, whether she and her legal team had a plan of strategy to respond should Heard file an appeal, Vasquez said, absolutely. Mr. Depp ended up filing his own appeal, so that the court could have the full record, she explained. And, Heard, insists on continuing to litigate this matter, and we have to protect our client's interest. Johnny Depp responds after Amber Heard begins appeal process, we remain confident in our case. King then asks the attorney, how do you heal and move on when both sides are still in court arguing? It's pretty standard legal procedure, said Vasquez. We just are hopeful that the court will uphold the verdict, which we think was the right verdict, and allow both parties to move on. Asked whether it's safe to say if, heard, hadn't appealed, you all would not have appealed either, Vasquez responded, yes. That's a very fair statement. This was never about the money for Mr. Depp, she also said during the interview. But in order to protect his interests, as his representative, we have to respond to the appeal with his own appeal. While the jury in Fairfax County, Virginia, found her defame Depp in her 2018 op-ed and awarded him over $10 million, they sided with Heard on one of her three counterclaims, finding that Depp defamed her via comments made by his attorney Adam Waldman in 2020. A source close to Depp told People last week that it was an overwhelmingly positive verdict for the Pirates of the Caribbean actor, who believes that this is a time for both parties to move on with their lives and heal. The insider added, but if Ms. Hurd is determined to pursue further litigation by appealing the verdict, Mr. Depp is filing a concurrent appeal to ensure that the full record and all relevant legal issues are considered by the Court of Appeal. Earlier this month, Judge Penny Oscarate denied Hurd's request for a mistrial. In a statement about moving forward with the appeal, which will require her to post a bond of the full damages amount she owes, a spokesperson for Heard said they believe the court made errors that prevented a just and fair verdict consistent with the First Amendment. We are therefore appealing the verdict, they added. While we realize today's filing will ignite the Twitter bonfires, there are steps we need to take to ensure both fairness and justice. Reps for Heard have not responded to People's request for comment about Depp's counter-appeal, 